Hey guys, it's Lauren. I just wanted to give a quick check-in since I had my surgery last week. Um, today is day five. Uh, last Thursday, I had a surgery to remove a pilonidal cyst off my tailbone. Um, really, I just wanted to check in and let you guys know how I was doing because I did talk about it. Um, I'm moving a little rough. It is a little hard. My incision's pretty big. Um, I have four stitches, two on top and two on bottom, and they left quite a large chunk in the middle open so it could heal from the inside out. Um, worst part of recovery for me is that anesthesia hangover that comes afterwards. My throat was bad. Uh, my body was sore. It just did not feel good. Um, and now, you know, I am struggling to sit up. I have a really nice cushion that I'm sitting on. I spend most of my day laying on the side um, or on my stomach. I can't really lay on my back right now or lean back. Um, but I know that I had discussed with you guys that I was having this surgery, so I just wanted to kind of check up with you and let you know how I was doing. Um, I, I don't go back to the doctor until next week, but... Yeah, so if anyone out there has to go through a pilonidal cyst removal, I know a lot of times they do it in office and it's not like a full-blown general anesthesia, anesthesia surgery like I had, but um, yeah, mine, I don't, I don't know why the doctors chose to do the surgery the way they did, um, but yeah, I went in on Thursday. The weekend was a little rough. Um, today's Tuesday and... Uh, Pain-wise, I feel like I got kicked in the butt by a horse. Um, <laughs> it's it's been a little rough, <laughs> but uh, I I you know you kind of once you have one of these cysts, if it doesn't go away on its own after being drained, you you have to go through this part. Um, it'll probably be another week before I'm fully functioning again, and then a couple weeks before it fully heals. Um, but the recovery from it has been a little more than I expected it to be. Um, I keep forgetting to take my painkillers and that is not smart. Uh, mine was likely from an injury, but a lot of times it's an ingrown hair that starts it. I think the reason they went the route they did with mine was because it wasn't an ingrown hair. Um, anyways... I just want to give you a heads up and let you know I'm doing all right. I'm surviving. Um, my friend Casey was great with me the day of my surgery. My dad has been really, really helpful. Um, my kids spent the weekend with their dad, so I had some downtime. And my boyfriend spent the weekend with me um, helping out. So, you know, I haven't really been alone. I'm just, I'm just chilling. Anyways, um, I will be back next week to let you guys know how... Uh, my checkup goes and how the next uh, appointment goes when I discuss my skin with my doctor. All right. Thanks for always uh, asking about how I'm doing. Okay. Bye.